I was like, finally! God, what was it gonna take? Um, I'm a huge fan of um, Disney films. Um, I guess today my top favorites are Toy Story, Lion King, and the outtakes from Bugs Life. Um, but <laughs> I was honored. Um, I felt like I'd finally made it. Um, Cause you know, when you see Disney pictures, there's usually big names, large names attached to the characters. So I was, I made it. I made it. How about that? <laughs> I play Yes, and that's Yes with three S's. Um, and she's the head algorithm of a very popular website called BuzzTube. And um, Vanellope and Ralph have a big bill to pay with eBay, and so they need help. A overzealous person at the arcade is playing, and they break the um, steering wheel. So you know that the arcade games are kind of like outdated. So where do you go to find the, the part? The internet. <laughs> so that's why they come to see Yes, because um, they did a whole bidding thing on um, eBay, and you know, you can kind of get a little crazy, because it, it becomes a, you know, those bidding wars, they become competition. And so they got a little overzealous in the bidding, and now they owe a crazy amount that they can't afford. So they come to Yes, to the internet to help. Yes represent she because she is the algorithm of the internet she's the moral compass she can kind of take you through and tell you what's what where to stay away from <laughs> um she can help you if you have a plan or you want something to go viral she can help you she can aid you in that um she's just the go-to person of the internet pretty cool i think i was in the studio for like over a year just doing the recording but i was told that it was four years in the making because there's so much, you know, but when it all comes together, we think, oh, they did that in like a month. No. <laughs> it takes a lot of people and a lot of time to make an animated film. So that was, um, that was really interesting to watch her grow. You know, every time I went into the studio, they had another color, another hairstyle, another outfit. It was just beautiful, great process to be a part of. John C. Riley actually is, I'm a fan of his work. Um, he has something that makes you want to reach through the screen and hug him. I don't care if he's playing a villain or a sweet person. You just can't get past it. You just want to hug him. Even his voice, his voice draws you in and make you want to pinch his cheeks or roll him up and put him in your pocket. And Ralph is a big guy. <laughs> and he's kind of intimidating. So you kind of need a voice where you're not afraid of him. And John C. Riley just brings so much humanity to that that character. He really does. Sarah Silverman is an incredible character actress, in my opinion. Um, I love the things that she can do with her voice, and I love that, that she has a vehicle where she could show how talented she really is. I mean, as soon as, I knew that was her. Like, the first time I didn't, you know, of course they did the press and all of that, but when you hear it, it's like, that's Sarah! Like, <laughs> but, it's Sarah as a little girl, if that makes sense. <laughs> She's so good. Hey there, here's today's daily fact. The snow in The Wizard of Oz is asbestos. Mm. In that famous poppy field scene in The Wizard of Oz, the snow coming down is calming to Dorothy and her potty, but they should have probably been far less relaxed as these were actually asbestos-based fake snowflakes, a popular Christmas decoration throughout the United States and Europe at the time. Now click here below to subscribe for more great content.